Hi, and welcome to this opening episode for GMX. We are at GMX here in Nashville, Tennessee, and I'd like to introduce you to our first guest. This is Adam from Dark Knight News. Is that correct? It's correct. Oh, man, and this is the real Dark Knight. We've run into him several times. Look, just, just look at the things that he has put time into. This is completely amazing. Is, it, is this your first GMX? It is. And so I got to ask, are you going to be here all weekend? If I can be, yes, I'll be here until I melt. Now, I have to ask, you've got all this get up. It probably took a very long time, makeup and everything. How much time do you spend to put into this? Ten minutes. <laughs> ten minutes. I love it. Now, if I could get out of bed in the morning and get ready in ten minutes, that would be awesome. Now, guys, make sure you check him out. Like I said, he's everywhere on darknightnews.com, correct? That's correct. So check it out, darknightnews.com, where we're going to start out this episode with Dark Knight News. All right, so like I said, we are starting up here at uh, GMX, and we've got all sorts of things going on behind us. We've got the GMX logo. We've got Mr. Jeremy Miller here, who's actually one of the head guys here at GMX. Now, now, don't let this fool you. He's actually not as tall as he looks. It's all in the shoes. It's all special effects. <laughs> so, uh, like I said, this is Jeremy. Jeremy, tell us what we got going on all this weekend. We have insanity going on, Rusty. We have so much stuff. We have a ton of guests. We've got some great people. Uh, Billy West, Futurama, Rob Paulson from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, Animaniacs. We have Dio Kanei, starred as Thresh in The Hunger Games. We have Ella McLean from Portal. We have Doug Walker, Nostalgia Critic. Uh, we have 45 guests or so. Uh, over 200 panels, events going on. Just a, a just nonstop programming content. All kinds of really fun things. A lot of interactive content. So, how much sleep have you had since we got started? For the last month, I've been averaging about four hours a night. So. <laughs> He said last month, not past few days, last month. So you're getting ready to, this is going to be your last 48 hours for a long bit. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to get much sleep, but that's, you know, that's, that's all part of the job, but we love it. All right, well, we're going to let you get back to work. And thank you very much for hanging out with us, sir. It's good to see you. Good to see you. Like I said, we're going to be here at GMX all weekend long. It's 48 hours of cool, 48 hours of nerd, 48 hours of everything that is awesome. Check us out. It's what is, no, it's geekmediaexpo.com. So as you can see, GMX here, all the people were absolutely geeky, absolutely nerdy, absolutely crazy, absolutely awesome. It was nothing but 48 hours of fun, and these are the sort of things that we want to bring to you. Look at the lines. Look at the people. It's all madness. Check out another interview right here. All right, and more stuff coming out of GMX here in Nashville, Tennessee. We're down in Franklin uh, talking to the what? <laughs> well, I don't even know what's going on. But, no, we're sitting here talking to Chad Ryden. He just got off stage doing his comedy stuff, and you did a great job. You had the crowd going. How does it feel? Uh, it feels pretty nerdtastic. i I got to tell you, I feel awesome right now, you guys. I, I will say this. You got to tell some jokes that I haven't heard before because I've seen you a lot outside of here and you weren't able to tell a lot of nerd jokes. How does it feel to speak to an audience that knows your jokes? Uh, I don't think they know my jokes at all, which was well. great. Uh, <laughs> yeah, because it's generally the same old shit over and over and over. And then, uh, but yeah, like, no, I, I played here last year. I guess uh, I don't think I overlapped any material. But yeah, it's a good chance to pull out stuff that. Well, you know, maybe gets a timid response from a yeah. third of the audience somewhere else, but here it's such a specific group of people. Like it's 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 my people. You know what I mean? So it's like okay, like maybe they're not into the weird niche thing that or niche thing that uh, <laughs> that I like. But but in general, like the people here are way nerdier than the average oh, yeah. goofball that shows up at a Friday night at a comedy club. So <laughs> yeah, a lot a lot of crap that just wouldn't fly anywhere else is going to be really great here. And, and likewise, if I tried to come in here and do club material that just wasn't specific to this audience, I think it would fall flat. So it's yeah. it's always cool to go somewhere that's like a unique experience and then be able to just uh, embrace that, you know? It's sweet. Not only embrace that, but he embraced it double-fisted this evening because we ran into him out in the hallway, and literally the first thing I saw, I was like, hey, there's Chet, and he's already, and there it is. <laughs> 
Yeah. No, he's he's. I think you said you were had to bring some drinks back for somebody. Yeah, I was uh, I was in a panel and I started coughing. I had a bad cough, and so I thought I'd either die in there and embarrass myself and yak up something gross, or come get a drink. And I was like, well, I got to bring back one for my friend, otherwise. Yeah, yeah. I'm an asshole, and I don't. I, I'm already an asshole enough without having to, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Come back in with booze and be like, yeah, how are you doing? I don't, I don't, you know, so. All right, well, we'll let you get back to that. Go ahead and serve that beer up. And always don't forget your website, the homeless. Dot com, everybody. Just do your part. Fuck the homeless. Fuck them hard. Uh, pick up two or three, make it a party. That's all I'm saying. Just do your part, everybody. Thanks, man. And we'll have you. more from GMX. Then there were robots, more robots, and, well, plain more robots. There were pieces laying everywhere, all being parted together to make giant robots, medium robots, small robots, and all sorts of stuff. Check out all the fighting going on. Are you okay, guys? We need we need the live shots, the di action, the bodies, and what what was that, uh, and that. Well, as you can see, it's a very different episode of Tex Nation TV we have going on today. We're actually live at Cool Springs at Geek Media Expo, which we've been telling you to come to, and we haven't seen you like come up to us and go, "Hey, you're the guys from Tex Nation TV," but eh, whatever. As you can see, tons of people, tons of fun, geeks, nerds. I mean, where's my TI-85 calculator? Ah, no, yeah, they didn't get that. Who do we have here? Oh, look at this guy. It's the captain. Hey. All right. So we'll end it that way for the captain. There was so much more going on in GMX like R2-D2 with the Star Trek crew. There was this Jeopardy style cartoon game. There were the Marvel Hornets. And there were even these crazy dogs. As we found out, we lost most of our video and even the outro. So the only thing we can leave you with is thank you very much, GMX, and this awesome Decepticon tire.